Hello. Thanks for calling the value mail. Danny, what's going on, dude? I got uh, two quick things for you. Hell yeah. Uh, so the first thing is just a thing that I kind of thought of. Um, I don't really believe that, uh, most of the top officials in government, uh, take climate change that seriously. Um, I think they want everyone to drive an electric vehicle so that they can shut down your mode of transportation, uh, remotely. That's interesting. Uh, Can't they do that, that with even a, com- like, um, the super, uh, computerized, like combustible, um, like current engines. Like if, if you have a gas powered engine, but it's one of the more modern cars that are, you know, full of essentially a computer, like, couldn't they still do that there? Uh, yeah, there's probably a way to it. Um, I've always driven the old pieces of shit, so I'm not yeah, really yeah, sure yeah, for sure. Anything before that. Cause I mean, that's the whole thing now with all the car thefts and stuff is like, it used to be, you actually have to break into a car. Oh, you got to turn down your thing in the back there. Uh, can you yeah, I can hear you. Just say, okay. You got to turn down your radio. It's like okay. the eighties people. Um, <laughs> yeah, but, but I mean, they can do that now. But I mean, yeah, like all the all the co- you hear all these car theft rings, and they'll just like program a fob, and they'll just take your car from your driveway. Yeah, I know there's some stuff with like OnStar and shit like that too. Um, but yeah, that's I think it would be easier just with like everyone straight up driving a Tesla, just because yeah. they're plugged into the internet. That's but uh, that's the other true, yeah. uh, the other thing I had for you um, was about your financial downfall with sure. the uh, with the crystals. Uh, with the crystals. Actually- <laughs> so if people don't know. We were talking about this on the boys cast, but I uh, got my girlfriend when we were in Texas a year ago. She got this money crystal, which is literally a piece of fool's gold from this guy who was like selling it on the side of the road. And he gave it to her. It's almost like a like a horror movie or like a like a you know it's like a, um, a Halloween type movie. It's like with the monkey paw or something, you know? Because like he just he goes here, just he was selling them, but he saw her and he goes here, just have this. And he gave her this money crystal, and then ever since shit went sideways, I still haven't <laughs> I still haven't thrown it out, but. Uh, just giving people some context. So anyways, continue. Yeah. So, uh, I'm actually dating a girl, um, that she, uh, she practices paganism and she does witchcraft. Um, and she's into the crystals and whatnot. So I asked her about your situation. (laughs) Uh, and, um, like she's, she's all in on it. Uh, I'm not, um, but she is. And what did she think? And, uh, I, well, I asked her about it and she said it could be a couple different things, but, uh, she said, more than likely what it is is because you took the situation as like a joke or whatever, like jokingly yeah. accepted the crystals. Uh, she said it was probably bad karma that got mm. you. Well, here's um, the thing. I never even was given it. It was my girlfriend was given it. And then by, I wasn't even given it. It was always hers. It was never in my possession. But then yes, me and Ryan did make fun of the whole situation. Interesting. Yeah. Um, so I asked her about remedies to uh, help cure your situation. Okay. Um, what she said is she would suggest that you do an egg cleanse. Yeah. Um, it's it's something to do with like rubbing an egg on your body to extract like um, bad energy or something like that. And yeah. then I'm pretty sure you boil it and then you discard the egg. It's it's something along those lines. So uh, it sounds like said, I'm going to have to shove a hard-boiled egg up my ass. Is that what I'm understanding? <laughs> I mean, if you do do that, please do it on live stream because we'd love to see it. <laughs> That's um, going to be on the Patreon. <laughs> Thank you, shoving no um, shit up my ass on the regular stream. Um, and then the last thing she said was you need to, uh, you need to get rid of the crystals. I do uh, need to get rid of the crystal, right? Yeah. So that that was that was her uh, synopsis was to do an egg cleanse. You could look that up on like, specifically how to do it and to uh, get rid of the crystal. So you know what the problem with getting rid of the crystals is? Because I obviously said it, but I was saying it jokingly or whatever. But I'm like, the moment I actually get rid of it is when I believe it. The moment oh, yeah. I go and throw that thing out and I pick it up, it's in my bathroom right now. I pick that thing up and I toss it in the garbage is when I've officially bought into the whole yeah, oh, just okay. have a just have a bundle <laughs> of sage on hand and start burning that shit and uh and you know do the do the egg thing. Yeah. All right. I'll try what's it called again? What's the egg thing? It's an egg cleanse. An um, egg a- cleanse. Yeah, it, it's something about transferring like the bad energy into the egg and then you discard it. Okay. Uh, I can't talk you through the specific I, I see steps, it right now. It, it says how wiki how how to do an egg cleanse. 
maybe we'll maybe we'll give a look at that on the uh, after show as well. Now, question: So your girl, this is your girlfriend. How long have you been together? Uh two months, I think. Now we've just been kind of hanging out. Cool. And so she's. Did you know from the jump that she was a witch? Uh, I did. Yeah. Um, she. Uh, her family has been practicing um, Norse paganism for generations, like from the time her. Uh, family way back when immigrated here from uh norway okay uh, they've been practicing uh norse paganism and has, and have then, you seen any cool things that she's done or is it just like a lot of chick nonsense um it, it's mostly the girl stuff that you talk about um i don't really buy into it um it's it's her thing i don't really you know give her shit for it but um but like i mean at some point you're gonna be like having a you know sour mood and she's like all right we gotta egg cleanse you like you know the longer you're in this relationship with her the more you're gonna have to buy into this stuff to a degree well here's the thing is i'm actually moving states pretty soon so we're not we're not like getting super serious we're just hanging out and enjoying each other's company but what if she's casting a spell right now for you to like fuck up your life so you have to stay why I asked her that, I was like, when I move, are you going to, are you going to like, uh, hex me? And, uh, she's like, no, I won't do that to you unless you piss me off. But, uh, yeah, I don't apparently it. she's, <laughs> she said, she claims that, um, her mom has, uh, hexed people to make them shit them, shit their pants and that it's worked. So, so take that for what you will. Interesting. Making people shit their pants. All right, that's a uh, all right. That's an interesting one. Well, I'm gonna check out this egg cleanse. Um, sounds like nonsense, but who knows? Anyways, thanks for calling. All right, it was good talking to you, man. Appreciate thanks. It. Thanks, bye.